Hey there guys and welcome back to this channel, Past Papers 101 with Miss Edwards. Exams are near, exams are near. We'll be looking at the CSEC Integrated Science Paper 1 for 2013. So let's see what we can do with this paper. Alrighty guys, let's go. Question 1. Item 1 and 2 refers to the following diagram of a typical plant cell. The structure labeled T is the, if you said cell wall, you are correct. Question 2. The structure labeled X is the, if you said nucleus, you are correct. Question 3. The structure responsible for the transfer of characteristics from parents to offspring is the C chromosome. Question four, which of the following word equations correctly summarizes the process of photosynthesis? Is it A, B, C, or D? If you said D, you are correct. Carbon dioxide plus water, light energy over chlorophyll gives you glucose plus oxygen. Remember that equation. Question five, which of the following shapes describes molar teeth? Remember molar teeth are the ones in the extreme back of the mouth. The answer would be B, rounded. Sorry, not rounded, C, flat top. Question six, which nutrient is important for building strong muscles? If you said D, protein, that's correct. Question seven, in which of the following processes is glucose converted into carbon dioxide, water, and energy? In this case, the answer would be C, respiration. Question eight, which of the following systems is likely to be affected by the presence of dust in the air? Is it the digestive system, the endocrine system, the respiratory system, or the circulatory system? The answer is C, the respiratory system. Question nine, which of the following air pollutants combines with the hemoglobin in the red blood cells? The answer is D, carbon monoxide. Question 10. The names of three types of blood vessels found in the human circulatory system are arteries, veins, and if capillaries sound familiar, that's because it is. The answer is C, capillaries. Question 11. Which component of the human blood transports oxygen? Is it A, platelets, B, phagocytes, C, lymphocytes, or D, red blood cells? I guess you're thinking red blood cells. You are correct. Question 12. The amount of water entering the tissues of the body is controlled by, is it ejection, nutrition, excretion, or osmoregulation? Answer is D, osmoregulation. Question 13, antibodies are important in the human body because they A, control hormones, B, protect against diseases, C, help make red blood cells, or D, regulate blood glucose levels. The answer is B, protect against diseases. Antibodies are made by your white blood cells. Item 14 refers to the diagram below, which shows sever several labeled structures in the human eye. Which structure is responsible for carrying impulses to the brain? Is it A, B, C, or D? The answer is C. Question 15. Which of the following hormones regulates the level of blood sugar in humans? If you are thinking insulin, you are correct. Question 16. Which of the following sequences correctly represents the order of the processes involved in the reproduction and growth of plants? 
if you are thinking C, pollination, then fertilization, then germination, you are correct. Remember, pollination occurs in the flower, then it leads to fertilization. And after fertilization has occurred, you will have a fruit that will eventually have seeds and then germination can occur in the seeds. Item 17 refers to the diagrams below, which display seeds under different conditions in four test tubes plugged with cotton wool. In which test tube is germination most likely to take place? The answer is B because it has air, moisture, and also it is at a suitable temperature at 28 degrees Celsius. So the answer is B. Question 18. Which of the following hormones is produced in emergency situations? Is it insulin, secretin, prolactin, or adrenaline? If it's thought adrenaline, you're correct. Question 19, which of the following methods of birth control is most likely to require an accurate prediction of the ovulation period? Is it the rhythm method, the barrier method, the surgical method, or the hormonal method? If you thought about rhythm, you are correct. Question 20, the testes of the human male correspond to the anthers of flowers because they both... C. Produce male sex cells. Question 21. Wet clothes are most likely to dry quickly under conditions of... Is it high temperature and low humidity? High temperature and high humidity? Low temperature and low humidity? Or low temperature and high humidity? The answer is A. High temperature and low humidity. Question 22. Which of the following is the method of heat transfer that occurs in fluids? If you said B, convection, you are correct. Question 23. Solar energy is transferred through space by, is it radiation, convection, conduction, or evaporation? The answer is A, radiation. Item 24 refers to the diagram below, which shows part of a nitrogen cycle. During which of the above processes is excretion occurring? Is it I, II, III, or IV? The answer is C, III, because it's showing animal protein going to body waste. Remember, excretion has to do with the getting rid of metabolic wastes from living organisms. Item 25 refers to the diagram below, which shows a food web. Which of the following organisms are herbivores? Is it a dog, goats, fungi, or bacteria? Herbivores would be B, goats. Herbivores are animals that only consume plants. 26. Which of the following is not a cause of soil erosion? Is it A, terracing on hillsides or off hillsides? B, heavy water runoff on unprotected soil? C, the plowing of land during the rainy season? Or D, allowing sheep to graze a pasture after the cattle are removed? If you said A, you are correct. Terracing of hillsides does not cause soil erosion. It actually helps to prevent soil erosion. Item 27 refers to the diagrams below, which show an experiment to measure the water drainage of clay, loam, and sand. Which of the following statements is most likely to be true? And this is a repeat question. The answer would be C. Soil 3 is clay. Question 28. The boundary formed by the meeting of two air masses is called a zone, front, cloud mass, or storm surge. If you said C, cloud mass, you're incorrect. The answer is actually a front. Don't let the word mass fool you when two boundaries of air masses meet. When the boundary meets, at the boundary where the air masses meet, that's called a front. Which of the following fishing methods is least efficient? Is it a drift net, a trawl net, a long line, or a hand line? The answer is D, a hand line. 
30. The process by which water passes from the ocean to the atmosphere is A. Respiration B. Evaporation C. Precipitation or D. Condensation The answer is B. Evaporation Question 31 Question 31, which of the following processes used in the treatment of water will eliminate harmful bacteria? Is it aeration, filtration, fluoridation, or chlorination? The answer is D, chlorination. Chlorine, adding chlorine to water will kill bacteria. 32, which of the following is not a water safety device? Is it A, a life raft, B, a life jacket, C, an inflatable tube, or D, an inflatable balloon. If you thought inflatable balloon, you are correct. 33. Which of the following gases is associated with the scuba diving hazard known as BENZ? Is it A, oxygen, B, nitrogen, C, helium, or D, hydrogen? The answer is B, nitrogen. 34. Which method of waste treatment is least harmful to the environment? Is it A. Burning, B. Burying, C. Recycling, or D. Landfill? If you thought burying, you are incorrect. Or if you thought D. Landfill, you are also incorrect. The answer is C. Recycling. 35. The following conditions exist inside a pile of decomposing garbage. 1. It is moist. 2. It is warm. And 3. There is much organic matter, meaning much decaying or rotting matter. Which of the conditions above make a garbage pile suitable for the laying of housefly eggs? If you said all of them, you are correct. Question 36. Which of the following protective wear is best suited for someone welding a broken iron gate? Is it a goggle, a helmet, a glove, or a chest mask? If you said goggles, you are correct. Remember, welders use that torch, so they have to protect their eyes. 37. A carbon dioxide fire extinguisher works by... A. Cooling the fire. B. Including oxygen. C. Excluding oxygen. Or D. Spreading out the heat. If you said C, you are correct. 38. Which of the following is not a conductor of electricity? Easy, easy. The answer is A. Rubber. 39. Which of the substances listed below must be present for rusting to occur? Is it oxygen, water, or oil? The answer is A. Only water and oxygen must be present for rusting to occur. Oil would actually prevent rusting. 40. Plastic is used or is usually used in electric plugs because plastic is D. A poor conductor of electricity. 41. Windows made from steel will rust quickly by the seaside and this is because the air by the seaside has a high concentration of oxygen, iodine vapor, carbon dioxide or sodium chloride. If you said D, sodium chloride, you are correct. Remember, sodium chloride is another word for table salt or is the chemical name for table salt. Which of the following chemicals, question 42, removes nail polish? B. Acetone. 43. The following data were obtained in an experiment to investigate in which soil pH different crops grow best. Which crop preferred a neutral soil? The answer is B. You're looking for 7. 7 is the pH for neutral. Which of the following substances will produce a suspension in water? Question 44. The answer would be clay. 
Item 45 refers to the following statements about detergents. One, they form scum with hard water. Two, they are made from crude oil. Three, they are biodegradable and do not cause permanent damage to the environment. Which statements are true for soapy detergents? If you said the answer is A, you are correct. The false statement there would be that they do not cause permanent damage to the environment. 46. Which of the following metals produce hydrogen gas when reacted with hydrochloric acid? The answer is iron. 47. What is the reading on the meter? If you said B, you are correct. Question 48. A refrigerator has a rating of 0 0.5 kilowatts. The electricity used in kilowatts per hour by this refrigerator for one day is equal to? B. The kilowatts divided by the amount of hours in the day would tell you how much it uses per hour. 49. Which electrical component is designed to melt and break the circuit if too much current passes through it? A. A fuse. The unit of current is the A. Ohm. B. Volt. C. Watt. Or D. Ampere. If you said B. Volt, you are incorrect. It's actually D. The Ampere. Volt measures voltage. Don't let that one trick you. In the Caribbean, question 51, the energy used in the production of electricity is derived mainly from A, waterfalls, B, fossil fuels, C, solar panels, or D, wind turbines. It's B, fossil fuels. Question 52 refers to the following diagram of a spanner below. The spanner above is an example of A, a lever, B, a pulley, C, an inclined plane, or D, a hydraulic, a hydraulic press. It's A, a lever. Question 53. The diagram below shows tongues with labels A, B, C, and D. In which of the labeled positions is the effort actually applied? Is it A? B, C, or D? If you said A, you're incorrect. It's B. This is where you would apply your effort. Question 54 refers to the following sources of energy. You have coal, wind, solar, and natural gas. The question asks, which of the above are referred to as alternative sources of energy? If you said two and three, you are correct. Wind and solar only. And that's C. Question 55. Which of the following formulae is set to calculate the mechanical advantage of a machine? The answer is B. Effort divided by load. Question 56 refers to the following picture of an athlete jumping over a hurdle. This question is always on the paper. And by now you should know that the energy she's using to jump the hurdle is C, kinetic. Question 57. Which of the following de devices does not use an electromagnet? A relay, a light bulb, an electric bell, or an electric motor? If you said B, a light bulb, you are correct. Question 58. There are limits to the height and mass of material which can be transported by a vehicle. The reason for this is... The answer is D. To ensure that the vehicle's center of gravity is not raised beyond safe limits. Question 59. Which of the following energy conversions take place during the process of photosynthesis? If you have D, light to chemical, you are correct. 
And the last question, item 60, refers to the diagram below, which represents the passage of air through the engine of a jet plane. The direction in which the plane is moving is B from Y to X. And that is the end of the test. Thank you for watching this video. Hopefully you saw answers to questions that you did not see before or on previous papers studied. All the best in your exams, guys. And remember, with God, all results can be distinctions.